Ariba Myra is an engineering services company providing engineering, verification and validation services to the world's automotive industry. Electric vehicles mean that we have had to tailor our approach because while the engine noise has gone, we now need to give more priority to reducing road noise and to reducing wind noise. We also need to address the new noise sources that come from the electric machines and the inverters. If you take away the engine, um, you take away the pleasing sound of the harmonics of the engine, you are left with the harsh aspects of the sound, you are left with the broad sound quality. So noise, vibration and harshness is an important attribute in a vehicle. Um, uh, increasingly so these days, uh, as customers expect a level of refinement in all vehicles now that maybe years ago you would only expect in, in the luxury end of the market. We would bring the vehicle into this location in order to instrument it ready for test. Transfer path analysis is important. It's a powerful tool for us to quickly and robustly determine the source of an MVH concern. What I'm showing on the screen here is some data that was acquired using SimCenter Test Lab. So it's, it's noise as the vehicle accelerates, and there are some microphones at the driver's ears. And this plot on the left is the noise recorded at the driver's ear. And the important features of this figure are these diagonal lines and they represent the features and the noise. If we don't have these features, we don't know if we're accelerating or decelerating. So what I've got on the right-hand screen is a plot of what's called prominence ratio. It's a sound quality metric. And what that is telling us is, is firstly, this is a very good vehicle. The motor tones are not very prominent. What is prominent is this feature here, and that is associated with the switching frequency of the motor. It's one thing creating a software that is mathematically correct, but it's far more difficult to create a piece of software that has been implemented in such a way that it can be effectively used in a commercial environment. Siemens with SimCenter Test Lab have actually done that very, very well. One of the advantages is that, it, that we can collect the data and do the analysis all in one platform, and we can do that on the fly so we can be on the proving ground acquiring the data, getting a real result in front of us straight away and making decisions to move the development process forward. The complexity of product development is increasing all the time as, as vehicles grow and in fact will become even more complex with autonomy. The productivity we gain by applying tools like those we get from Siemens is really important to the speed and cost of the work we do for our customers. This project allowed us to further push our application of the Siemens software and make deeper our understanding of the behaviour of electric vehicles.